Good afternoon, good afternoon, BCers. I'm coming to you all. I ain't got no thing on the heat. Did you pause it? I get it. No, I didn't. Why? I didn't. It's okay. I'm coming to you all. I had to put a button on my head. Y'all got my hair played. I'm sorry. Uh, my name is Daphne Ball, and I come to you all today to cook. But what I'm cooking today is something that I haven't cooked before. Um, it's a trial and error uh, type dish because like i said we're trying to eat more healthier so what i'm going to do is we're going to have a dish that's going to have i've got some organic ground pasta rice pasta i've got um bell pepper and onion cut up i'm going to salt it a bell pepper onion it's going to be kind of like a spaghetti type dish and then i got me some hamburger meat this hamburger meat is hot do you see this little pack of meat seven dollars oh my god and uh i've got a uh, Pack of spaghetti sauce. I've got a small can of tomatoes. I got a can of tomato paste. I got a can of pasta sauce for cheese. And I got a traditional hunts. And I got I got my salt, pepper, onion powder, black pepper, complete season. I'm just gonna make this dish. This is my first time trying this dish. It's just something off the top of my head. And you know how you get used to um are tired of eating the same stuff so this is going to be one of these dishes that i'm going to create and i'm going to be doing a lot of these from now since we're trying to eat healthier and cut out a lot of carbs and stuff and try to eat a more filling meal and stuff and as i said this morning when i was on my reels i have lost six pounds yes in a week so i am doing good and my daughter celine she's lost hmm 13 pounds. My son's lost five. I don't know how much Dundon has lost. We ain't tried it with her yet. But I'm going to cut this eye on and give me a little, um, I ain't got that much. I don't need that much. Just enough, um, olive, um, olive oil to get it started. I want my bell pepper onion. And I like my, and I like my bell pepper onion to be crunchy. I, I don't like it to be, um, even when I make spaghetti, if I make chili, whatever, we like our spaghetti and stuff for our pasta to be, um, to be, uh, crunchy. We don't like ours to be, like, soft for some reason. Yeah. But everybody is to each their own. Everybody likes stuff a different way. So, you know, that's just how it is. I'm going to open this can of tomato on my it's getting hot. So then you turn the air on. I had turned the air off, you guys, because the temperature had dropped and it had got kind of cool in the house. So when I'm finna cook and I'm already sweating in this bonnet, you guys. I'm gonna open my sauces up and everything. Have them together. And I normally put sugar in it, but I'm gonna put a little splendid in it or something like this, similar to that. Oh, look at that tomatoes. Yeah. So I'm trying to get all these cans open up. I try to get everything prepped so, you know, you won't have to be waiting on me to open this, do this, and do that. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. That's how we cook. So I got this. Getting hot. Hopefully. It's hot enough. And I got my water boiling from my uh, pasta. And I'm just doing a small bag. I'm just doing one bag. I normally would do two bags, but I'm just going to do one bag since so it's a trial and error dish. But, um, like I said, last night we had, uh, uh, we had, uh, turkey cutlets. And I had seasoned those turkey cutlets. And I had, um, salt and I had, um, put them in a skillet and just kind of browned them. And then I got some, a pack of brown gravy and put over them. We had brown rice. And we also had green beans. This is what we had for dinner. I made LaDonna some mashed potatoes, but I uh, meant to get me a cauliflower where I could make us some cauliflower mash. That's the, that's the new thing I'm going to introduce to her. Because we're trying to get it together. And I like my vegetables to be big. I don't like my vegetables to be small. I don't like my vegetables to be small. It's because I don't want to mess up some in this pot. And that, y'all, let me tell y'all, I have got so many pots 
I mean, sets of dishes that I haven't used. I got a set of dishes that I got on Black Friday about maybe two years ago, you guys, that I haven't even opened. They're red. They're beautiful. And they're, they were the tasty. I'm going to season my veggies. Um, they were the tasty. Um, yeah, I don't measure. So don't, don't say what's the measurement. You just don't have to season till you think it tastes how you want it to taste. And I, I got this from my grandmother. My grandmother never seasons anything and season anything either. She just, you know, put everything in the, in the thing and, and cook them. So I kind of cook like my grandmother. I don't, um, I don't, um, I don't see. I don't want to measure. Unless I'm baking. If I'm baking, I'm going to measure if I'm baking. But I don't want my stuff to be jacked up. But my grandmother, when she cooked, she didn't, see, she didn't even measure. She had a little teacup. I don't know where she got this teacup from, you guys. And she had a little bit of teacup, and she used that teacup to measure. It said that teacup was a cup. But I don't know if that teacup was, I don't think that teacup was a cup. Because you know those little China, little fine China back then, you know, they used to have like the SNH green sand. And that's where she got the, um, teacup, had a teacup, a tea set. Really, and all that she had, we had broke up all the stuff, and all that she had left was the that teacup. Whatever she used that teacup for was measuring. And y'all just gonna start this these until they get kind of translucent. Get on my hammer, add a hamburger. Meat. Well, y'all, this is only a pound and a half of hamburger meat for seven dollars. It's like a dollar, five dollars a pound, five dollars on a pound. And I had hamburger meat in my freezer, but guess what? I forgot to put it up. I didn't know what we were going to, I didn't, I didn't know what, what uh, we were going to cook. That's one of the things. That's, that's how it ended up being like this. Because I didn't know what I was going to cook. And I'm spilling, burning stuff all over here. I try not to splash and go on and stuff. I'm going to be cooking and stuff. So, yeah. But you know how that goes, honey. I got my water ran and... Everything and kind of get it together. Yeah. It's kind of good season. I don't know how I did all that, you know. But you know, that's how I roll. When I got this pot, I'm going to end up putting my, putting all it together in it because I know I'm going to have to put my sauce off in it. But I know this um skin is not gonna it's not big enough. I'm just trying to get my business out of there. Yes, yes, yes. So I just decided I cook more. You know. Yeah. And then I had and I had weighed myself, you guys, last week. And um I guess I should have been weighing myself. I think I was weighing myself too soon. But I had weighed myself and I wouldn't. I said, I hadn't gained, I hadn't lost a pound. I said, I know good well. I could tell my clothes, my uniforms I went to that work in fit me different. But I knew I had lost some weight. But yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead on and open this camera to me and put it off right here. But I think they're they're um it's it's how I want it, it's fine. I don't know what I'm gonna use it out I'm gonna try to come with this camera to me. Add it in here and kind of put a season on top of it. Put this pack in the truck. Madonna, for some reason, wants to be the one to put stuff in the trash. And if she sees like packs of meat like that, paper like that, for some reason, she wants to um, she wants to um, take all the paper off of it and um, put it um, put it um, in the trash. And so I always try to be careful. And usually I'll just um I'm just gonna put look at the side now. I'm gonna put you in because I'm um, here. Yeah. I already got my I'll just play it in layers, you guys. I'll just play it in layers. And I already wash my hands, y'all see it just I just wipe this stuff down when I get through because the dollar gonna come if I if I leave anything sitting out of pocket, guess what the dollar do? She come right behind me and put everything over 
where she think it's supposed to be. And I don't got used to her now, so I be ready. And I, and I get through doing what I do. I put it back so she won't have to be um, steady um, moving around. That's why she's not in here now. And y'all, she woke up early last night. I'm going to try some of this. A little Tony Sasha. No, it's not open. I'm going to put it open. I'm going to do a little bit of this cage. I'm going to do just a little bit different. I think last night I put a little bit too much of that cage of seasoning on my um, on my um, they cooked this last night and they were kind of um, spicy to me. Now, they might not be spicy to my kids, but they were spicy to me. And I can't eat a lot of spicy. The hot stuff. I can eat it, but when it come out, it don't like me. So I don't eat it. And y'all see how by the time I get the hammer, it's going to be a certain color. And I even got my cup right here for my grease in. I got a glass up under my container, up under my counter where I get them from, um, like I have like pickles and different stuff like that. And I use those glasses and um, put the grease in them. Yeah, and I guess and I don't wait out there. Yeah, I'm just crazy too. Just trying to be quick on that. So this meal shouldn't take that long, but it's just a trial and error meal, you guys. It's my first time trying to do this, and so we're gonna see how it turns out. And once I get the meat kind of brown enough, I'm gonna try it. Y'all see the pinch up in the tray, see the spin up there. I'm going to um, fry in them. I got big water in here and my dog. Let me see my water up again. Yep. Yeah. But this is a pioneer woman set. This pot is. And uh, my daughter likes pioneer woman too. And so I guess I like her too because everything she buys me is pioneer woman stuff like this one. Hot here, tiny woman, those little sit ups, and then uh, those utensils. And uh, I got the knives, the knives, I got them over here out of the Donald's Beach, so I got the pioneer woman knife set. So I guess I'm pioneer woman back. Yeah. And I put those over there in the cutting board and all that stuff. I move all that over there. I don't think O'Donnell would miss it now, but you know, I just try to make sure everything out of her way. This is the finished product, you guys. Look at that. And I even, look at that. It's kind of with the pasta with it, you know, the rice pasta being rice pasta. You really probably need to not even do three minutes. Because if you want to add it to something else, but you guys, it tastes amazing and it's good.